So can you try to fill in the blanks, please? Yeah, and this is again about under, under think. Yeah, so under the head of think, what is the main role of you as the leader? Fill in the blanks. The first blank is four letters and the second is seven. Come, give me some ideas. Wow, we got it the first time off the bat. Ayodhya, right? Wow, shall we give a big clap? Ayodhya. <laughs> Help my team member to succeed. What do you think? What do you think? So there are whole books written on leadership, which are all great stuff. But if you summarize all of that into one sentence, I truly believe this is it. Help my team member to succeed. Now, why is this so powerful and so important? If I say, Danul, if I say, Danul, my role as your boss is to get the maximum work from you. Danul would be very happy because he's smiling, he's very happy, right? <laughs> How many of you would be happy? Your boss says, ah, I want the maximum from you, there. My role is to get, like, really squeeze you and get the maximum from you. You'll be happy. And if boss... Please squeeze more, right? <laughs> <laughs> now that could be interpreted in so many ways, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> the moment they feel they are being used, they will want to leave. But interesting, isn't it? You know the classic definition of management. You go to the textbook definition of management. What is management? The textbook definition is getting things done in and through others. That's management. My role is get things done for you. Does that make you happy? I think, Ani, please get more things done from me. I want to get more things. Get more things from me. But if I, huh, we have to add more some, some sugar, right? And whatever, right? So if I say now, Danul, Danul, my role is to help you succeed in your career. I want to help you succeed in your career. I want to help you build your career. I want you to be successful as a professional. How would you feel? You will feel happy, right? So if I say, Danul, my role is help you succeed in your career. You said you will feel happy. How many of you would feel happy? Akila boss says, Akila, my role is help you succeed in your career. How would you feel? So friends, how many of you would feel happy? Now, if I'm helping you to succeed in your career, are you going to do good work? Ah, now if let's say Fatima is not doing good work, say hey, Fatima, come on. Yeah, I'm trying to help you to succeed. You are not helping me to help you. How can I do this? How can I promote you, which I want to do, if you do not do this side X, Y, and Z? Now, how would you feel? Would you feel angry with me for saying that? You'll be angry. You'll feel bad, but will you feel angry? There's a big difference between feeling bad and feeling angry. No, you're not doing your best. <laughs> you're going to feel bad. Sanjeev is trying to help me. I am not doing my part. You are going to feel guilty. You are going to feel upset. Come on, Fatima. How can I help you if you don't do this thing? Yes. Look at it this way, right? Think back to school days now. For most of us, it was like a couple of years ago, right? School days. <laughs> Think back to school days. Janaka, a couple of years ago. Think back to school days. Were, were there teachers there who, you know, were really tough? Would scold you if you don't do your work properly? Yeah? Would somehow get you to do the homework? Would somehow make sure that you listen in class? Would, would maybe scold you might those days because we, when we were in school, corporate punishment was also there, would hammer us also sometimes. Yes? But if you see that teacher today, you'll walk across the road, go and talk to that person, say, Sir, Komada, can I give you a cup of tea? How many of you do that? See? Because at that time, although we didn't really like that, today we appreciate that and we think, I am here today because of what you did for me. Yes or no? There are also some teachers, if I meet them today, I would, I would ignore them, yeah? They are the teachers who came to class and told us, look, I am not going to teach you in class. If you want to study, come for my tuition class. There were teachers who told me that. And what I am telling you is, I don't respect them at all. <laughs> hey, why should we? <laughs> there would be teachers who come and say, today I am feeling a little lazy, so I am going to read the newspapers. So you all do whatever you want, right? At that time, we were like really happy. Wow, free period! <laughs> today we look back and think, I understand it. How many of you played sports? School, uni? Now, coaches are not the easiest to work with, right? Especially if you're a winning team. If you're a winning team, that coach has been probably very tough, right? What was the sport you played? Rugby. Which school? St. Joseph. St. Joseph. Tough coach? 
You all would have been a good team. You are still a good team, right? Now you are the best team. <laughs> Jamaldin, okay. Okay, tough coaches. So when you run and run and run and run and then they're tired, run one more. No water break. No water break. <laughs> right? You understand? Yeah? But today you look back and think, wow, because of that coach we won. And some of the best moments of my life are because I won. Helping the team to succeed. Are you understanding? Doesn't that make sense? Because if my only goal is to help you to succeed, I don't have to think of what to say. I don't have to think of what to feel. Because that is my motivation. That's what's driving me. Is that making sense to you? Is that making sense to you? Yeah. <laughs> Very simple, right? But doesn't this really summarize everything? <laughs> yeah. So it's not the leader trying to get work from the others so that the leader succeeds. Ah, if you go to your team and say, guys, see, I've been having an old Mercedes now for the last 10 years. I need to get the new model, right? You can see there are new models. There are so many people driving these new models. Don't you think I deserve a new? Guys, you need to work harder, achieve your targets, so I can get a better Mercedes. Come on. Can't you support me, Yusuf? <laughs> <laughs> then why do I care? But isn't this what we say in other words? We go to a team and say, Work hard, we need to increase profits. The board has given us a target, we have to increase profits by this percentage. Who cares really? Do you guys really care? Do you all care really care? Think about it. Right? 